the time that you and the light ceases. Can you pick what organs you want to donate? Wait, so if I give up my organs? Because I don't want to donate my eyes. Okay. 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 Okay.
in any episode as it is made and intended, I believe it is for four to eleven year olds. It's some at least somewhat mature. You know, most most kids television shows are made for kids, obviously, and so and as such they're usually immature. They have the characters don't have much of a personality or they have very simple personality, very simplistic, and very childlike. In this show the 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 adult or the uh, the characters rather are more more like adults, more like more like people that have more developed personalities because the show is more well thought out than typical kid, kid shows. The message is everyone can learn from them. As I mentioned earlier, adults can learn from these messages as well as kids, and they're also very important in their life. And if you're thinking, bronies are not just guys in their pit living in their mom's basements who have nothing else to do with their lives. It's also very successful people, and in some cases, people who have money. There's nothing wrong with bronies. They're not hurting anyone by watching the show. They sit and watch the show. They, they may be buying merchandise. They're not going out and murdering people because of the show or anything like that. They're not breaking the law. There's no law against adults watching shows aimed for kids, am I right? They're not doing anything wrong. What's wrong with watching a kids show? Maybe it's a little bit silly. Maybe it's a little bit unusual. There's nothing wrong with it. And most importantly, suddenly we have a mass of adults getting into something good. Not that there's anything wrong with Call of Duty or violent video games. But suddenly we have adults getting into something that's completely devoid of anything evil whatsoever. Don't laugh until you try it. Why hate something if you don't even try it? I mean, if, you, if, if anybody has never watched the show, what business do they have hating on people who watch the show? If they if they did watch the show, this brings me to my next point: love and tolerate. You know, I don't expect everybody to love bronies, but I do hope that you guys will tolerate them. Because if you even if you watch the show and you don't like it, you don't think it's something for adults to watch. What what does it hurt you if they are watching it? So why not just tolerate them and let them go up from the place? Watching my loved one does not make them homosexual, nor is this any any indication of homosexuality. Even if it is, I bring this goes back to my love and tolerate. And you can see you can have the character ring the dash, which is mean, which is hypothesized by many, mostly haters, to represent the uh, le lesbian, gays, bisexual, transsexual community. This is not necessarily the case. This is not this has not been the case uh, indicated by Hasbro, which is the producer of the show, the show. Even if it is, I go back once again. Love and tolerate. What's wrong with it? In conclusion, I hope that most that everybody will top will love at least tolerate watches of my little pony. Maybe even try it yourselves. But my main point is that there's nothing wrong. With it. There's nothing wrong with people watching the show, there's nothing wrong with people of adults, adult age watching the show, and there's nothing wrong with the fandom in general. My work cited are The Five Stages of Groaning, a video on YouTube, The Questry at Daily.com, Groaning Facebook Posts, MeFace.com, and Personal Experience and Knowledge. Okay. So, Brony is just a fill in the being. A brony is not like this horse name is brony. No, a brony refers to people of adult age who like a brony. Like a brony. Yeah. Met a brony. A brony. Right. It's like a what? Bro. A bro. bro. A pony. Like, you know how to do it? Get out of here. That's awesome. Bro. Brony, I'm thinking this one. <laughs> I, I did not know that. I still watch I kids. Love it. Man, I'm not watching yeah, Disney Channel by yourself. Mm -hmm. Nice job, Alan. I'll questions? watch. Um, Any more questions for Alan before we move on? Like I knew of My Little Pony has been around for years. Yeah, I, yeah, I didn't know they existed. I didn't know there was a subculture. Yeah. I didn't know, yeah, yeah, I didn't know it was like, anything to do exactly. with that beyond like, like the child age or a What's his show. name? What's the rainbow one's, one's name? Okay, Brian W. I just have one thing to say that my friend.